Yeah, feel free to point out any problems. Don't hold back. It's just a preliminary plan. I don't have any ideas right now, so I invited you to help me brainstorm. You're not just gonna watch me struggle, right? My body is free, but I'm shackled in spirit. Thomas asked if I wanted to have a small gathering at home, you know, to relax and socialize. But then he immediately went to my aunt, and they decided that I was going to host a family gathering. Yep, Talia the busy multitasker. It wasn't until she contacted me to finalize everything that I realized they already made their move. They said it was a rare opportunity, and so a few friends also wanted to join in. By the time I noticed something was wrong, our small gathering of three became 17 or 18. <sighs> I mean, we haven't seen each other in a while, and it's not like everyone's free all the time. A small gathering wouldn't hurt. But do I really have to be the one to plan everything? I got an online consultation. Sadly, the proposal was too fancy and tacky. It didn't meet my needs at all. So I figured I'd just do it myself. Thomas used my name. If it doesn't live up to their expectations, my reputation is going down the drain, you know? It's why I invited you to experience the joy of party planning in person. Time isn't on our side. Shouldn't we start now? I mean, you're already here. You don't want to see me mess up everything, do you? I just wanted something classy, cozy, tasteful, and thoughtful. Clearly, this is a them problem. You're right. So let's not waste any more time. Why don't we come up with our own party? More... You summarized the important parts. It's doable. True, true. Okay, everyone's invited to appreciate the sea. <sighs> but I'm flexible. Actually, I have a new plan now thanks to your suggestion. It's foolproof. I happen to know the perfect place for shopping. You'll like it. Why don't you see it for yourself? Oh, I thought you already knew. You're the one planning this party. I'm just the humble shopper.
Good afternoon, Miss Bodyguard. That sounds awful. I don't like it, but I like making wishes come true. So, what's your wish? You're out of luck. It's already taken. But you can drink whatever comes out of the shaker, though. Why else would we be here? These are some of my favorites. I'm not sure how to feel with you smiling like that. Okay, I know I'm not a wine connoisseur, but didn't you say we need to consider everyone's preferences? By the way, I've thought of a good party game. We each mix cocktails, and we don't tell them who made the drink. We make them guess. What do you think? That's exactly what I want. Not bad, yeah? The owner made them himself. We're in his glass palace, so to speak. Huh? Where are you? I was wondering why I couldn't find you. The other fish took you away. It's mediocre at best. Anyway, I didn't expect you to be interested in fish lamps. There's another one, believe it or not. They say when you're interested in a person, you start relating everything you see to them. Do you agree? Was that a confession to these artificial fish? It's nice that you're madly in love with fish, but it won't help our party. Follow me. They're pretty good. Simple, warm, and brimming with ambiance. Who said we were gonna do that? Just toss it somewhere in the living room doesn't even need to be hung on the wall. A good atmosphere is whimsical. I knew it would suit you. If you like it, you should wear it to my party, yeah? <sighs> Fair. Why? A dress doesn't exactly bring out my handsomeness, you know.
I'm honored, my lady. You know parties are boring to me. This family gathering is an exception. As for the exception after that, who knows? I mean, if you really, really want it, sure. But for an exception on an exception, you and I should be the only ones there. You really are a good hunter. Your lung capacity is amazing. I was just about to get to that. I didn't expect you to start blowing up balloons just as I was about to go grab it. You should take a break, unless you want to be tired as soon as the party starts. There are only a few things left. I'll deal with them. You've worked hard these past few days. You're fast asleep. Let's see. Oh well, you'll just have to wear the dress next time. Nothing. Go back to sleep. 